Welcome everyone to my new episode of Price Prediction for Litecoin Cryptocurrency for June 2024. Speaking out here for the crypto which is still enjoyed by the community members. It also has volume, it is also holding a line that is very important in terms of future probabilities of bullishness. So why not putting together between my price predictions of June a series of videos and talking about it. Litecoin has been around for quite many years. It is no longer the cryptocurrency holding the spotlights. It is no longer a cryptocurrency that is riding momentum and popularity. It's true. We do have trends coming out constantly. We do have all sorts of cryptocurrencies that are filling gaps in the markets. And we have other projects as the nature of humans enjoy the new things. To, you know, humans usually enjoy to participate in whatever represents a change from an actual status into something new, something different, something that could promise something we don't know what is going to happen. A cryptocurrency about which we pretty much know the all-time high, know the situation of it, know the activity of the last couple of years is in a different sector. And this is where Litecoin is situated along with many other ones. Especially responding to the question, why is it so many people enjoying to deal with cryptocurrencies that are quite new and wildly uncertain about their future? Well, because that thing realistically attracts people, especially the ones which are looking forward to having massive returns on their resources. Not really looking forward to connecting the massive that the way you will to have a massive return and you have that right so there's no correlation if you want to have a massive return with the fact that you're going to have a massive return on your resources when dealing with those cryptocurrencies you got to be careful about if something is promising you 10x 15x 20x 30x there is no correlation between the promise and the level of uh del deliverability right so that's it now before we continue, a uh, quick eye must be put together towards BTC, which is in a good shape right now. And it is about to change the market structure with this zone support confirmation. We'll still need two hours and 30 minutes for the scandal to confirm as it is. And this level of 66.5 up to 67 grand is actually a zone of change of market structure. If you confirm above that, and this would be the second confirmation, you are, uh, especially because you're positioning yourself near to the all-time high, you are going to target directly the all-time high situation. So this is opening the doors for a very strong altcoin market movement, especially after the Ethereum spot ETF has been approved. Beautiful, guys. Now, what do we got to talk about? Well, first of all, it's the one-on-one -on -one coaching. If you care about your education and believe that by improving your skills and education, you improve your results of your performance, well, this is the place to do it, including the darn for you trading. I'll talk about it at the end of the video, guys. Now it's time to share my thoughts on the weekly candles for Litecoin. This is where we are. Still being suppressed by the 200 days moving average, but heavily supported by the other three moving averages existing, such as 150 and 20 days. The great part of this whole picture is that we're actually getting squeezed by the moving averages, which is always happening before a powerful movement is going to appear. Now, this is the case scenario for the actual situation, folks. The expectancies from here are to have two, three, four weeks of strong movements, which should take us into the resistance line of this ascending channel that we're dealing with. We're talking about $82 level right now, and the ascending triangle representation, not a triangle, sorry, the ascending channel uh, is going to have its resistance setting above $150. So, you know, it really depends when are you going to touch that. The later you touch this, the higher the resistance will be situated. That's the situation, folks. I'm not going to be able to target anything, anything less than that, right? Anything smaller, anything closer than that. And even though the target is very aggressive here, 82% for an initial move, I am still not going to, um, you know, 
uh, stop myself or any other way putting together a form of negativity around a such number. Litecoin is a crypto that is based on market explosions and as soon as it starts, it delivers. So I don't want to be part of uh, the case scenario which I have been experiencing in the past bull markets. For example, you're trading from here. And the market starts moving and you just, you know, consider that a sell off is, is coming in again and you just exit because then you're missing that particular part. Right. So you definitely don't want to get out of your long positions in the next resistances and tops without buying back because the expectancies are strong altcoin bull market. So you definitely want to hold on your positions if you don't know how to buy and sell or sell and buy professionally you definitely want to just hold on your positions and ride the current waves uh you know movement of litecoin at that time was 700 percent in 203 days we did not even start at that scenario and then that situation this one right here would be just the beginning folks 85 percent should be delivered and i would not be surprised at all to see that in a single month so at the end of the day some of you just like i said might think this is too ambitious for a crypto which is showing signs of uh lack of life it's true it has not been the most enthusiastic place to deal with your resources in litecoin for the last uh, couple of years that's the reality yeah there is still room for this one to react so if you have been waiting for such a long period of time, if you have been enjoying, if you have been looking forward, or if you still want to look forward dealing with this one, then right now it's definitely not the uh, ideal time to leave the boat. Due to the fact that we're getting closer and closer uh, to that very strong move that is expected in the altcoin sector, which is going to throw us into that resistance. And then from there, we would like to see if there's going to be a form of resistance like this the next target should be 230 240 supply we're going to fly through basically the golden pocket of that structure quite quickly reversal back to the golden pocket and trend line which are going to meet at this level right meet at the 200s get your 200s and get to the all-time high folks this is the direction this is the route which is uh, sounding uh, really familiar a really welcome and pleasurable but at the same time we do have the practical side and the execution side missing as of now of course you can still be uh, playing around this level without too much volatility and enthusiasm in the upcoming weeks it wouldn't really bother people yet that one decision of blowing out and starting the alt season is going to be made in a moment which will change the entire market situation folks and then you might find yourself in a very very late momentum to get back in the business that's it folks let me tell you an example of how people um, lose uh, their entries in bull markets they're expecting basically from a ranging momentum which is usually appearing before the market kicks off they're expecting a sell-off because they expected during the range a pump it didn't happen so they're now bearish which is false it's wrong and because they are bearish they're expecting a little decrease on which they are planning to buy it's not appearing the market blows out from a range continues like that and what do they say well, I'm looking for seeing the retracement. I'm going to enter in this movement. I'm looking forward to seeing the market going in all time high. I definitely want to be part of the bull market, but I just want to see that retracement because I don't want to FOMO. I don't want to jump into an actual strong move that can easily reverse. So I don't want to buy into the green candles that are strong, which means that the markets are going higher and higher and higher. And psychologically, the person is getting more and more frustrated about the situation that, you know, it missed so many possibilities. When the market retraces a little, a lot will come out and say it's the end of the bull market. The bear market starts. We're going to see 50, 60, 70 percent retracement. So the guy again is going to pretty much uh, not touch the markets and allow the space to execute itself. Of course, 
we get that situation quickly bought back up and we're riding the waves higher and higher and higher and the person is going to get into the same emotional feeling of frustration and stress around that missing some great opportunities and entries meanwhile he's going to give up on his discipline and buy later that later will be the top and this is how people lose money right so keep that in mind folks check out the coaching program and trading video i'd like to explain you more in the upcoming minutes and now i would like to talk for those of you that believe in education and care about their performance so it's time to share more details about my one-on-one -on -one coaching program this is done with me live where i'll take you by hand just like i said and teach you how to trade from a to z which means starting from the mindset psychology side into the technical analysis understanding the language of the market encrypting the charts and being familiar with the language in terms of what does the market communicates with you understand the whole process and then know how to react to those messages that the markets are delivering to you guys knowing how to react obviously is a sophisticated process how to trade when to trade what to trade when to exit how to exit and how to deal with an active trade all the situations that are considered complex and a trader needs to know whether we talk about part-time or full-time trading it doesn't matter what matters is you need to increase your educational level in order to perform in the markets correctly and most likely in a predictable way trading is not gambling not at all trading is a type of activity where a person is trading an asset when the probabilities of a direction are very high so he has the ability to recognize those moments when a probability compared to the other so a energy of bullishness or bearishness is having a very very strong possibilities of going into a direction this is when a trader steps in and it is in advantage towards the market so he's trying to make money with that that's the whole idea of the process it's definitely not something that has a very very high level of unknown and random outcome at all the times no there are situations like that as well i can confirm that been trading since 2014 full time but the idea is that there are situations where the randomness or the unpredictability is not high and that makes the spots for the traders so check out the video to understand how does it work register now for a free conversation with me a one-on-one -on -one coaching where i'll take you by hand between four to six weeks and teach you how to trade on zoom conversations with homework with exercises with everything that is needed just like for the completely done for you on the trading side if you'd like to be part of my trades you can definitely do so without any prior fees just a commission from the profits we earn commission is paid by you every seven days this is my journey you can check out the links in the description area in the comments area for everything it's completely done for you we are using our chat gpt bot for trading it helps us to perform and help us to run the analysis and it helps for the accuracy side so it's done through api trading permission and it's simple straightforward i can explain you more just reach out to me if you think this is a good option for you have a good time around it Subscribe to the channel, like the video, and we'll talk to you soon.